All right, so here we go. We have shield, and I have this trigger and trigger lerp enemy. I'm gonna throw that out there, and it's gonna require two nodes, and the nodes should be mounted. Let me see something here. All right, negative x enemy on top, and enemy below. So when I hit play, they may start charging after me, shoots based upon seeing me. So if he sees me, and I have to shorten that box a little bit because the squirrel's lower. But what happens is the enemy will try not to let me get in back of him. But if I do happen to get back in back of him, he will just continue to fire. Perfect. That is exactly how I want, want it to work. Now, in different sects or different computers, this seems to run a little bit better. Like on my laptop, for example, uh, the whole lerping thing works great. Absolutely no flaw. On my iMac computer, a little bit differently. So you're going to find different scenarios where, you know, as you're starting to pull assets or game objects or child parent things going on you're going to find different computers handle that a little bit better a little bit differently so don't be too hung up on how the dynamics work remember i had a dynamic speech out there all dynamics are different uh it's not like real life where uh, every every space on earth is a good place to do uh, physics okay in in the co in a computer environment that's not true uh, not every computer handles physics the right way so you have to have a, a good card a good physics card in there to be able to handle the physics same is true with any kind of lerping situation or any kind of uh, game oriented operation different computers will handle it differently all right, that means when you export it to the web, it should work just fine because the uh, engine's so limited to what it can do as far as bounce around objects or lerp around objects. It's a very simple thing. It probably just sees it as turn around. But I hope you enjoyed the creating of the enemy character. That is the conclusion of the 2D side scroller enemy. Uh, we'll go on to something different here in the next series of videos. Uh, to make it more interesting and maybe I can pull some more examples out as far as uh, just what we've worked on now. Uh, a 2D side scroller works good for pulling some examples, but I would say not all examples.